In the 20th century, statistical mapping was firmly established as a powerful tool of government. In 1940, these ordinary American citizens had no idea they were being watched. Over 4,000 miles away, someone was counting them and plotting them on a statistical map. And this was the result. A map of America, seemingly rather innocuous, with neat little pie charts showing the percentage of European immigrants in each state and the countries down here that they came from. But this is also a classified map. It says up here in the corner, for official eyes only. This was a map that was made by the Nazis. The map was part of a secret mission to flood America with Nazi propaganda. By 1940, Hitler had already invaded much of Europe. Britain was next on the list. The British were desperately trying to persuade the Americans to join the war against Nazi Germany, but President Roosevelt was reluctant to act. There is no demand for sending an American expeditionary force outside our own border. There is no intention by any member of your government to send such a force. You can therefore nail any talk about sending armies to Europe as deliberate untruth. The Nazis were determined to bolster Roosevelt's resolve to remain neutral, and they were leaving nothing to chance. Using statistics from the latest American census, they were drawing up a map that pinpointed the biggest communities of German immigrants living in the United States. The large red segments in these little pie charts identified the best targets for propaganda. The map revealed that the Nazis should focus their efforts in the rural communities of Missouri, Wisconsin, Nebraska and Texas. This was where public opinion could be most easily manipulated to oppose American intervention in Europe. In 1940, this dry statistical map was actually a weapon of war. Maps are incredibly powerful objects. They touch the mind, but they also touch the soul. They magically conjure up places that we've never even seen. And it's that power which leads them to being exploited or even perverted. <laughs> 